Today's update we see released from Zwift is to the companion app with some enhancements made to the meetup functionality. Meetup functionality allows anybody to create their own group ride on Zwift based on time or distance and invite all their friends along. I'll put a link below in the video description to my previous video on meetups if you're not familiar with those, but today's updates include, well, the ability to select any world and a number of courses on those worlds. So we have Watopia, Innsbruck, London, New York, Richmond, or Yorkshire to choose from now. Previously, it was Watopia and the single guest world. So this has really opened the doors for a lot more events to do. It doubles the invitee list from 50 up to 100, which is gonna be a welcome change that was limiting a few of the clubs getting on board with the bigger groups. And there have been a few minor updates behind the scenes. Nowadays with hundreds and hundreds of clubs and social groups on Zwift using the meetup functionality for their group rides, these updates are gonna be very welcome. Okay, what do they look like? Let's pull up the app and have a quick look. So here we are, we'll give some ride-ons first. Done deal. And we go over to events. Click on the three person group icon there. We will create a meetup. First at the top there, creating a ride. Today, 5 p.m. in half an hour as a test, we'll do that. Where do we want to go? Now we can select the list here. So Watopia, Innsbruck, London, New York, Richmond, or Yorkshire. The two event only courses, Bologna and Crit City aren't selectable. They are event only courses on Zwift, but this does add a ton more features. So let's go to, let's go to Yorkshire. We'll select that from here. We can select any number of the courses there, the predefined courses. And we'll choose Duchy Estate, just a very short one for the test run there. Four kilometers, no problems at all. Remembering for the invitee list, they need to be following you to add them as the ride leader. So hopefully my wife is following me on here. We'll go Veronica Midic. Yes, she is following me. I can add her to the invitee list. There we go, Veronica. Customized meetup, again, we have none, so it's a group ride where you can ride off the front or drop off the back, or you can keep everyone together. That remains for the entirety of the ride, so use that sparingly when you need to keep everyone together. If there's a little race at the end, you can't use keep it together because, again, everyone will be kept together. And for the message, we'll put let's roll. Done. We hit create meetup. There also has been improvements made to the notification. So once Veronica has updated her app, hopefully automatically, it'll be an improved experience for her getting a notification and to join me for this ride. So there it is, today's updates on Zwift for the companion app in regards to the meetup functionality. I think they'll be very welcome now that we've got a lot more worlds to choose from and courses and the ability to invite a lot more of our friends. There are a number of tips and tricks people are using for the meetup functionality, which really do enhance the experience. I'll be covering those on videos in the near future. To be notified of those videos when released here on the GP Llama YouTube channel, be sure to hit subscribe. All right, thanks for watching.